Hi, my name is Austin Alexander. I'm a physical therapist and assistant professor of anatomy at Hardin-Simmons University. Kind of a lot of angles I was looking at uh, targeting. Enhancing virtual anatomy education. I started with a program known as 4D Anatomy. It's a virtual cadaver. It's a web-based software. Partnering with the Vibe Board and the virtual cadaver dissection, it's about as close as you can get to the actual real thing. The Vibe Board enhances virtual cadaver dissection while side by side enhancing real cadaver dissection. Here in this image, you can see we have the actual embalmed cadaver. We see a hand view that we can annotate on and really bring emphasis to various anatomic structures. And then furthermore, we can come over to the web-based software and really let students get that visual representation just like they're gonna get within the cadaver dissection experience. And now with Viboard, we're not limited to one virtual cadaver platform. Any web-based platform with a click of a button, now we can zoom in and jump right to the next virtual cadaver software. My favorite thing is the dual screen where you split the screen and I can annotate and I'm, I can have both of them running at the same time. The last week I'm presenting over the brain is I have my PowerPoint on the left and now I have OneDrive with an actual cadaver dissection recording that I did in the anatomy lab. And then I pull up the web browser. The versatility of multiple platforms running at the same time, able to function very seamlessly between them. Sometimes I'll put the Vive Canvas up. I'll take some strategic note, um, kind of like if I'm the instructor, I'm teaching the presentation, but I have the Vive Canvas up and I take my notes and then at the end of the presentation, I can click share. And to other people, I've already recommended it to other, some other universities and I've demonstrated it to almost every program at our university. Most programs that don't do cadaver dissection in undergrad, they're, it's not translating well to graduate school. So our medical students are learning on these models and cat dissections and all these you know, things that aren't human. It's not translating well to um, success in medical school. We're finding if they don't take three semesters of anatomy education with cadaver dissection, it's in medical students there's not a significant difference in grades from students that did do that versus students that had zero anatomy experience, which to me, that's like, okay, we need to revamp. We need to do things differently at the undergraduate level.